Hi everybody, Brian Valenti from Red Rock Micro. We're here to talk about rigs for video DSLRs. So the first question you want to ask is why do you need a rig at all? There's a, a, a number of different reasons why. Number one, the first and most important is stability. These small cameras are an absolutely fantastic engine for creating video, but by themselves are very unstable. So we want a way to hold the camera and to move the camera that doesn't introduce a lot of shake and jitter into the, into the um, resulting footage, and we're going to show you a couple different ways uh, to do this. The second thing that you want is the ability to add accessories. We're going to talk about a little bit how to pull focus, how to use a follow focus to adjust your focus, how to add things like filtration for light, and also how to add uh, external accessories like a microphone and some audio recorders, things that turn this from just a camera that shoots video into a legitimate and viable motion picture film uh, camera. The last thing you want is affordability. Obviously these cameras and part of their appeal is they're very economical, they're very inexpensive for the amazing kind of footage it produces. So we want things that are not going to cost a fortune or more than the camera body itself. The first rig we're going to talk about is one that's really geared for people who are traditionally used to still photography and like uh, a handheld rig that's much more out in front of them gives them a lot more mobility. This is a rig we have called the Event. You can see here are the critical pieces. We have what we call our DSLR base plate. It's a quick release system. It is the translation between a still photography camera and uh, the cinema accessories that we want to use and need. And as you can see, they pop right into our carbon fiber rods, which are very lightweight. This particular rig, as I mentioned, is designed for handheld use. So here you can see I can pop it off the tripod, and it's a nice handheld system that actually keeps the camera out in front of me. Very comfortable and familiar for people who are doing still photography kind of systems body pad and then an integrated uh, loop. This is a Hoodman hood loop, very inexpensive. And overall, this total system runs about $600, which again, we really want to focus on affordability. And the great thing about this is it's a style of shooting that a lot of still photographers are used to. They like to keep the handheld uh, feel to it and keep the camera out in front. And what's also great about this is it can quickly move into a tripod configuration. Quick release, just lock it down and you're ready to go on the tripod. Okay, so I promised some world premiere gear. Here's one of them right now. This is actually our hot shoe mounted top rail system. The hot shoe mount is actually surprisingly rigid and uh, stable and actually connects directly to the die cast magnesium body, so it's really strong. So what it allows us to do is actually just slide this into the camera. It gives us top rails, and what we can do is use something like a micro mount here that we have, attach it to the top, and this allows us to attach various accessories. In this case, I'm gonna use a, a little light panel just pop it in here with this applied stub that we have. And you can see that we have a very nice way, ready to go, great top rail system. It allows you to attach anything on standard 15 mil rods. Our next rig, which is popular with both still photographers and cinematographers, is our iSpy bundles. This one is fully tricked out. It's got some extra accessories. But this is a shoulder mount configuration system. It also shows our micro follow focus system. It comes with lens gears that work with your existing lenses without modification. There's no damage to using them all using standard film pitch gearing and allows me to actually adjust the focus uh, as I'm actually using the system for precise focus control. This system itself is designed to be a shoulder mount type of configuration and one of the unique things you can see is it actually can be attached directly to a tripod using this uh, base. So when I put it on my shoulder here, it gives me a number of points of stable contact so it's a very solid and stable rig. I can still reach up and adjust my focus and then back down on my second handle. Make this work. Okay, another world premiere piece of Red Rock technology. And what this allows you to do, as you can see, is mount accessories for counterbalance in a vertical position. And it gives you the ability to adjust it left-right so that you can actually adjust and balance your system left-right, which is a very unique capability. And especially when you have follow focus or heavier lenses on your camera uh, system itself, this is a tremendously helpful system to do. And not only that, but because it has a cheese plate, you can see that we've mounted all sorts of accessories here on the back. We've mounted a Zoom H4M, which is an audio controller, and an Anton Bauer battery, which can be used to power your camera, your onboard monitor, any other accessories that have a standard DTAP connector. So brand new technology. Look for this from Red Rock Micro shortly. The last rig we're going to talk about is the DSLR Cinema Bundle. This is a traditional cinematographer's tool. It's designed to provide the form factor, weight, and robustness of a traditional 35mm motion picture camera or other large format camera. So you can see it's used and it's designed to be uh, working with large scale accessories that you would typically find in a, mo a motion picture film set or other place where you really want the stability and the features such as a swing away map box, full scale uh, follow focus, 
and the rod system that's going to protect the camera. We're also going to show you some of the accessories that allow you to attach other components to these systems. This is our micro mount. It's a handy little uh, device that allows you to attach anything to a 15 millimeter rod. You can see I have a little spud that allows you to attach things, both male and female. And what's really cool is I have one attached to the top rails here. In addition to that, we have the micro arms which allow you to actually use an articulating arm to position these accessories once you attach them in. So I go ahead and actually pop this in here and uh, just tighten it down. Again, it's a quick release system. And what's really nice is I can then position this monitor pretty much wherever I want it uh, using this uh, articulating arm. So I can put it right here, for example. Keep in mind, we have a lot of other accessories that allow you to build your own system to exactly meet your specifications or start simple and grow over time. All of our equipment is made in America and Texas, and we invite you to come and take a look at our website and see what we have to offer. Thanks for watching.